as a black man, it just hits hard that, you know, stuff like this still happens today in 2012, and it blows my mind. That thought prevalent in the mind of every one of Bridgewater College's visible men. It's the campus group for men of color. The shooting of Trayvon Martin one month ago has made members of the group reflect. I really could have happened to any one of us. I mean, with Skittles and tea in your hand, you the next thing you know, you lose your life. That's really something that's deep and profound. Trayvon was walking home after buying some candy. The march for justice at Bridgewater symbolized that for the visible men, all of them wearing hooded sweatshirts as Trayvon was wearing when he died. The negative stigma of a black man with his hood up is something that some of the visible men blame on the media. To know that, you know, that may have had a hand in the actions that happened with Trayvon and Zimmerman, um, it really just it hits home for me because, you know, I am Trayvon. That feeling is one that many of the visible men have had for the past month. Despite facing adversity around the valley, they say the message of the march was a simple one. Myself and a couple of other um, minority people, uh, minority or people of color here in the in this area, have experienced prejudices, discrimination, and you know we're just trying to just sound the alarm that say, hey, it's time for some equality. Let's get along. Let's do this together. In Bridgewater, Dave Bikenish, WHSV News Three.